<clears throat> Alright, we're checking out a uh, late stream today. Whew. Alright, this is another new pack. This one is called Flat Stone World Progressions. Uh, it's a long name for a pretty simple pack. Uh, I added six mods to this pack, and that make, brings it up to 13. <laughs> uh, other than Forge, this mod had, this pack had, uh, just this one mod, Hearthwell. Apparently Hearthwell, ooh, and JEI. Uh, I added inventory tweaks, uh, carry-on, uh, a journey map, miles tweaks, a tombstone mod, because I had no tombstone mod, uh, and, uh, Fade Miner. <clears throat> uh, it is a custom world, obviously. It is a flat stone world. It's kind of like flat gen, but stone. Um, and the Hearthwell mod is... Um, I have all of these. These are just copies, because you only get one copy of the world. If you delete it, it's, it's just gone. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So I just made a bunch of copies. We're going to pick this one. It starts you with cheats activated, and in, it says creative mode, but it's not creative mode. Um, but basically, it's a new way of getting resources from nothing. Um, I know nothing about it. Never heard of it. Uh, I've played this pack for about five minutes, um, and died pretty quick because I didn't get torches put up or any kind of defense or anything. <laughs> and uh, as you can tell, there's nothing here, so uh, mobs were just everywhere. Uh, This thing, right click on the ground to breed life. Uh, it's not just a right click, you gotta hold it down. Oof. That gives you this fancy block of grass and it grows trees like super quick. I put ore excavation in this so I can just do that. So yeah, uh, this is what you get. <laughs> um, I need to move quick, because it's going to get dark. Uh, I need to make some tools, because I'm probably just going to dig myself underground. sword, just in case. But like I said, uh, this uses the Hartwell mod, and I don't know anything about it, nor do I know how to even start using it. The, that mod right there, this, this little thing that you get is the start of it, but other than that, I don't know. Uh, okay, we need to start digging. I feel like underground is a good idea. Or just building like something underground and then making a wall possibly around us. Uh, the mobs are vanilla. There are no like crazy, you know, mob things in here. So mobs are just vanilla. I have to build a thing. We need to get some torches going. to plant another tree. Uh, yeah, you in there. something small ish something small ish
Ah, wrong thing. I don't care about getting out right now. Um, we're gonna make slabs. There will be spiders, but whatever. I mean, there's there's nowhere to go, so I'm not all that worried about uh, getting out of here. Skeletons will be able to shoot in, but whatever. I'm just gonna go downstairs. I just want to keep people out. I'm gonna dig underneath. <laughs> I am not gonna stay up here. sucks. I gotta chill with the uh, vein mining. I got a seed, that's cool. Two seeds. I guess it really doesn't matter if I die. I'll just spawn right back here anyways. Well, I have no idea how to get water. I have no idea how to get anything. <laughs> I don't know how to get anything other than cobble and this little bit of dirt that I have. No idea. Chicken racer. How are you doing today, man? Get myself a little bit of a place to, to relax while we're down here, while we're waiting out the night. should have put in here? Something that'll tell me what this stuff is. Uh, not, re not too sure what this pack is about. It's basically survival in a flat stone world. Uh, <laughs> and that, but it, what it, it uses, okay, so this pack when I downloaded it had three mods, essentially, other than Forge. And it contains this mod called uh, Hearthwell. Hearthwell. Apparently, Hearthwell is a new uh, get stuff from nothing uh, mod, kind of like uh, Ex Nihilo kind of thing. Um, I know nothing about it, 
So I was like, hey, let's download this pack and learn Hearthwell. Uh, so I did. Uh, I added a bunch of mods to it just to improve a little bit of uh, life in general, like mouse tweaks, inventory tweaks, that kind of thing. Uh, a, a map. Um, but it's a flat stone world. I don't know how deep it goes. I just know it's flat. And I know nothing about heart heart well. Hearth well. Yeah, it's just flat. So other than basically forge and those few mods that I added to it, uh, it's vanilla. Uh, you start with this little thing, it looks like a little seed. Let's see if uh, I can find it. So this is Hearthwell. It starts with this thing, a seed of life. You uh, right click it like it's a bow and arrow on the ground, and it sprouts dirt and some grass and stuff in this one little special block here in the middle that, uh, I don't know if you can break it or not, but I'm gonna try not to. But you plant, uh, you plant a tree on that thing and it grows in seconds. Yeah, it's interesting, and I know nothing about it. I mean, it looks like it's got all sorts of blocks and, and tools, and it's got its own ore, and... Yeah. I don't know anything about it, but it's definitely, uh... It's definitely got some stuff to, to deal with here. Dust picker holder. Scorch grit. Makes crops around to grow faster. A nourisher. But yeah, I'm gonna add a uh, I'm gonna add a, a mod to this. I need to add uh I'm gonna add a uh, what should I add? One probe? Yeah, well, that's what I'm about to do. <laughs> that was the one that I forgot. I forgot I didn't have that. I'm about to do that right now. Whale hasn't been updated since 2017. Just download the probe real quick. I've now added more mods to this pack than it than it came with. I guess it would make it a little bit more hardcore, but I'm trying to learn a mod and uh, not knowing what anything is or what I'm looking at is a little bit harder. Yeah, I mean I've been using the one mod, the one probe for a while, uh, just because it, it showed up and was better than Wayla for some reason. Wayla disappeared or something. I don't remember what happened. People just stopped using Wayla. Alright, we're gonna shut this down. Blink screen for a second, y'all. For some reason, my Twitch launcher has been super slow. Taking forever just to launch the... the... the, uh, the play button. Thank you. 
Yeah, I don't even know if it's got a book or anything to like try to explain it either. I hope it does. I haven't even looked like on its website or nothing. I haven't looked up anything about it. I remember I'm playing this one. I have all these copies because it only comes with this one copy of the world. And if, if you delete it, it's gone. It's it. Can't get it back. It doesn't have, like, a map, per se. It just comes with this map. And that's it. <laughs> it comes with the save. <laughs> Alright, we got a probe. Excellent. And we are smothered in mobs. Do you guys have fun out there? Uh... Take this, please. Yoinks. What's shaking, Essa? In-game documentation? Yeah, it'd be nice. You'd think it'd be almost kind of a, a thing that you'd have to do. Like, it'd be standard, kind of. You would think, anyways. Uh, it's not going to have that recipe, is it? Kinda wanna go one more down. You in there. Alright, let's see. Does it have any anything that looks like it would tell me what to do? Let's see. If I want water. How do I get water? I don't get water from anything. A bucket of water? No. Water filled crystal bowl. Drink it. progress. Okay, well, I mean, either way. Shards. Freezer will freeze nearby water to ice or snow. Yeah, but how do you get, how do you get the water to begin with? Crystal bowl has no recipe. We can make these again. Shards. Where are shards? Where do you get shards from? Never make it another. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> You just kind of have to remember, like I remember when I first started playing, like you just have to remember the recipes. Otherwise you're just screwed. So it looks like there's a, a, a shard thing for like making recipes. Grinding wheel. Obtained by throwing a crystal into the nether portal. Okay. How do you get crystals? From killing mobs? Maybe you get it from killing mobs.
Glaze filled, soul filled, empty rod. It's an empty rod. Heavy nuggets. I have heavy nuggets. Heavy mix lump. Well, this is this is a vanilla recipe. What do you use a heavy mix lump for? Use it for heavy ingots. What do you use heavy ingots for? A slab lamp. Liquid souls. That sounds delicious. Sand burst seed? I want to know where the crystals come from. Mysterious mixture. <laughs> Mysterious dust. Where does it come from? Uh, you're supposed to be telling me this. Mysterious dust block. Right for the mysterious soul fluid. Maybe it's killing mobs. There sure is a lot of stuff in this mod that no idea what any of it's for. Cause I don't think there's even there isn't even a I don't think there's even any button commands for this thing either. For this mod. No, nope, there's no button commands or anything for this mod. We might have to go run around and try to kill some mobs. Let's see if they drop. See if they just drop anything. Mysterious bush. Honestly, I don't even know if there's like ore or anything. I'd like to know how deep it goes. I'm at Y59 right now, so I guess I could go all the way down to bedrock. Try to kill some creepers if they're still around. Once the sun comes back out. I can always make a mob spawner. This is a flat world. If I put enough torches around, uh, I'll cut off spawns and be able to make a mob spawner. Like a skyblock mob spawner. That seems like it would make sense, right? My guess is there's no ores. I'm also guessing there's no caves or anything like that. I'm assuming it just goes straight to bedrock. My pick is gonna die before I get anywhere near bedrock.
I want to turn. I want to turn auto jump on. Just for getting out sake. <laughs> no, give me the back. Did all the mobs die? All the mobs despawned because I went too far away. That's hilarious. Make a door. Fast the tree grows though, I'm not gonna lie. Is this, is this oh I wanna look at this block. Does this block have a name? Fertile soil from Hearthwell. I'm just gonna die of hunger. I don't feel like trying to save myself. I'm just gonna die slowly from hunger. Uh, let's put some more stuff in here. Get you cooking. We can light up the area a good amount. Fertile soil. You can make fertile soil. Shard of the root of life. It doesn't seem to specify where you get what shards you get. It just seems to just be you get shards from these crystals. And also, nor does it specify where you get the crystals from either. Anti gravity block. Powered gravity block. Loot kit producer. Tube recipes. I'm very concerned that maybe, maybe this is not designed properly for this world. That's tombstone. Like I feel like. I feel like there's something like I, I I need to know what how to start, and I'm, I'm I'm tempted to just look it up, but I want to kill some mobs to see if they drop anything. A lot of these things don't have recipes, and for a pack for a mod that's supposed to allow you to start from nothing, start from something you know, start from nothing to get something. When you click on a bucket of water, it doesn't tell you how to get water. It doesn't tell you how to get water. Uh, it... It is. According to the pack, it is.
It says the mod Hearthwell offers a new set of crafting mechanics in order to unlock all resources in the game. I didn't bother looking anything up about it. That's why I'm like, I'm, I'm clearly missing something that needs to get done that uh, I just don't know how to do. That's why I'm curious if mobs drop things. Really, just, just kill me. I can't, I can't jump to my death because of the ceiling. Thank you. I don't know. <laughs> Let's see, you get iron through a grinding recipe using various things of iron basis. So that's not the right way. Uh, separator recipes. Separates items into its components, consumes an iron for requires a multi-block structure. Something that requires a multi-block structure that doesn't tell you how to get the multi-block, how to make the multi-block. Um, I'm not sure what this is doing. Four iron ingots. Okay, so you put in a compass and you get four, okay. Smelting. So it almost seems like... Alright, I'm gonna have to look this up. I'm gonna have to look this back up. <laughs> I'm gonna have to look this mod up. Get everything without leaving your home, it says. Most of the blocks I was required to progress in the mod. It'll give you a general idea how most... The, the crushing block. And will give you a general idea of how most crafting mechanics work. It, it literally says works well in a flat... Is this... Is this pack made by the guy who made the mod? It is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it says works well in a flat stone world. I was like, hey, I'm playing a flat stone world. The objectives of this mod are that you build the machines you need and hopefully have fun doing it to give purpose to your home space and then everything is as simple as possible. Without leaving your house, you will get the materials you need to build and craft everything you need. Between crafting simple blocks and building multiple structures, you will never be idle. All Minecraft resources are available through progression. Okay. Okay. crushing block stone wood and charcoal so I did, so I was I was actually kind of on the right path just had no idea what a crushing block was the dark out dark out Ugh, I forgot I had to jump on. Alright, you keep doing that. You make me another one. I'm gonna dig one more down. Alright, 
right, so we need, we need some stone. We needed, uh, what was it? Uh, wood, okay, right, so that's wood, cobble. Right, can I use cobble or do I need stone? It's stone, right? Yeah, it's stone. And charcoal, wood, stone, and charcoal. Is it a one-to-one? -one? It's a one-to-one -one recipe, isn't it? Someone needs to get on this guy's, uh, page and be like, hey, uh, some in-game documentation would be excellent. Or like maybe a hint. Just a hint would be nice. You get two for that. You get two ingots for each mix. Okay. Crushing. Three and a block. That's cobble, dumbass. Achievements? Hmm. I do not know. I forgot how to check achievements in vanilla. Is it L? L didn't work. I just did that. Fucking finger Tourette's. <clears throat> what is achievements? Advancements. It is L. Oh, it's just got a conflict. The fuck is it conflicting with? Uh. Nope. Nope. Oh, there's Enderman just panicking out there. I forgot this is a vanilla crafting table. I need more stone. It's raining. Okay, so it says, it shows, uh, dropping this thing on stuff.
<clears throat> uh, I think you do it like this. Thankfully it doesn't have a durability. So that gives me stone dust. If placing your bottle, it will eventually become dirt. That's kind of cool. But again, I don't have any water. Uh. Crushing block. What are the uses for the crushing block? Gravel I won't have. Mysterious soul fluid. That sounds delicious. Ladders make sticks. Heavy fuel dust. Smells four items. Interesting. White brackish stone makes salt. I think I have to kill mobs. This kind of just has And sh Whoa, what? Use the various shards that you got from crushing crystals on the cores to infuse them with the shard element. Whoa, this gets pretty in depth. There's actually large multi block structures. Still confused as to how I'm supposed to get water and stuff. Well, let's try to kill some things. Ah, you. Sword versus creeper, creeper wins. Stop, why do all the zombies keep disappearing? It's just all skeletons out here. Does. Alright, well, so far mobs aren't doing anything.
sapling and then death sapling and then death block. Oh shit, that makes glass. That's kind of interesting. This stuff is. That's a crafting material. And apparently it's fuel as well. That weird coring stuff. Ooh. I feel like there's a learning curve. What do protection blocks make? Nothing? How do I get mystic iron ingots? Raw mystic iron. You need iron. <laughs> and this stuff. Do you have any idea how to get this stuff? That looks like sun with an amplifying tube times two minus the tenth what? Clay blocks to get clay, but you also need clay to get clay. You need clay to get clay. I am slightly perplexed. dust. It just keeps it, it's suggesting I make mist dust, but it doesn't tell you how to make mist dust. It says crush one of these things. It doesn't tell you where they come from or how to get them. Mysterious soul fluid. trees. I just have no idea how to grow, how to get the sapling for it. You can't build any weapons out of these heavy ingots, can you? Can't do nothing. Everything takes these crystals, which they tell you how not to get. Yeah, and these mysterious dusts in the trees. And the mist rods. The mist rods wouldn't surprise me come from the wood or something. Let's 
snag some free mob drops. But any of them are worth a damn. Well, I'll take the bone. So I don't know what to do with stone dust other than this. If placed near water, it will eventually become dirt. But there is no water. <laughs> so again, I'm missing something. Something is missing from progression that I need help with. Chicken King Spy. How you doing, man? Thank you. Yo, did my wife ever send you anything? She was gonna send you a present. I don't know if she ever did or not. I'm trying to learn how to do a mod. A mod here in... It's not helping me much. It's not giving me much help. I thought I was making some progress and then it's like, no, sorry. We're only going to tell you how to get this far from the fancy little pictures on the uh, website. Maybe I should go to like their GitHub page or something. Cause the one on the one on uh, Curse isn't that great. There's a Discord. There's a lot of cool stuff in it, but... She demanded, yeah. <laughs> something but I guess she hasn't yet different crystal shards okay but <laughs> the freezer will freeze water into snow rice there is no water or I there's no nothing there's no water to zone there's a fire it's just the generator block required to power the freezer requires lava there's no lava and it doesn't tell you how to make lava and I don't know how to make the trees because I can't get the mysterious rods. I don't know where the mysterious rods come from. I come from dirt. glass with a stone dust block. I 
And glass makes other things. But I have no idea what an amplifying tube is for. No, this this pack is is super super uh, plain. Like all that's in here is is this mod, this Hearthwell mod. Uh, I have no idea how to do anything else. Like we don't have the the main problem is that there's no book explaining what to do. And I'm kind of just trying to guess through, like, pages. Fine, run away. Ow. He was moonwalking for a second. I found out I can make this thing that crushes stuff. Uh, but then the stuff it crushes, I don't know what to do with that stuff. Oh, I got an arrow on my shoulder. Flint's just the normal whatever flint stuff. Uh, I, I need one of these things, like, really badly. Um. Because this is, like, what you need for, like, the next, basically, progression. According to the site. Uh, the stone dust only seems to be, like, really what anything is really worth doing. Tiny pile of heavy fuel dust. Heavy fuel dust. That's not, it's a dead end. These crystals, I have no idea where they come from. Nor where do you get clay from. <laughs> it just says, hey, crush some clay to get clay. So you go, alright, where do I get the clay from? Oh, just get some clay and make clay out of it. Uh, okay. Something's, something's wrong. There's an issue with this with this somewhere, and I'm, I'm either I'm missing it or he's just not explaining it very well. <laughs> he says, "Yeah, just build the machines you need." Oh, okay. Um, I don't know what machines I need. Okay, so again, I can get. Stone dust. Stone dust gets me this thing. This thing gets me nothing because I can't make anything else after that. I can make heavy ingots. What can heavy ingots get me? They can get me a slab lamp. Slab lamps don't go in anything. Yeah, that's why I was just out running around trying to kill some mobs, but I haven't gotten anything from them either. Uh, I'm trying to look for things that I can make with just what I have. can't make this stuff. I don't know, like... I don't know what this is, this is telling me. <laughs> Amplifying tube, raw SL block. Raw SL block requires clay that I don't have, and crystal blocks that I don't have. Because I don't have mysterious mixtures from mysterious dust, because it doesn't tell you where to get the mysterious dust from. It says, oh, use the mist rod, a rod for the mysterious soul fluid. Where do you get, where do you get the rod from? Where does the rod come from? Like, this is the part that I'm missing. I'm missing this part. I don't know how to get this part. There's no, like, custom mods. Uh, this is the part that I'm missing. <laughs> He's got a link on his, on the uh, mod pack page that doesn't work.
There it goes. I got it to work. Son of a bitch. See, this was my next thing. Okay, so with glass, you can make you can make some stuff with glass. You can make this thing, this empty rod. Uh, I was going to guess that that had something to do with the mysterious rod, because the empty rod doesn't make anything other than this machine. And that seems like a waste of things. So, we're going to make one of those, because his GitHub page uh, explains things a lot better than his uh, curse page. I got into the heavy ingot stage. I knew that part. Um, we need more stuff. Why am I doing it like that? I was hoping to be able to do this without having to like look at the website. So we had the first step, we had the heavy ingot. The next step is the empty rod. Turns out if you hold the empty rod in your hand, if you hold the rod in your hand, What was it? Uh, six nuggets and three pieces. Uh, nuggets. Uh, nuggets. So it turns out if you do this, it eats you a little bit, but it fills your rod. A little bit blood magic-y. No, that's that's from the that's that gray stuff that you saw me. That's from a uh, that's grave dust. It's from the graveyard, the grave uh, stone mod that I uh, added to this. This pack only had like three mo three uh, uh, mods in it. I added like mouse tweaks and a map in the corner and all that crap. Well, uh, sorry, I'm eating a carrot. I'm hungry. Now I got a missed rod. Missed rods. Now I gotta get this stuff. So you need a lot of these things apparently. Now it says once you get some of this stuff, you can amplify it somehow. Get out of here. I don't want none. I've already killed myself twice, just because I don't have any food to eat. Uh, so it says you can just kind of throw it at some grass. And then you wait. <laughs> supposed to wait but it says anyway 
So we're gonna need to make. Oh, hi. Where the hell did you come from? No, really, where did you come from? I don't have F7. Apparently it's too dark in here? I have a torch there and a torch there. How are mobs spawning in here? I mean, he was standing next to a torch. <clears throat> well, let's throw this on another one. I don't know if it's gonna spread. I don't want it to eat all my grass. Hey, what's up, man? I'm gonna need nuggets. I'm gonna need more cobble. Lots of glass. He be creeping. <laughs> Creeper's going creep. <sighs> Guess I just kill myself. I wonder if I can like beat people with it. It just kills me. Hey, look, grass grew. Climb it, wuss. Climb it. Don't be a wussy. Ah. Give me your string. I know, right? It's hoping. Mysterious bush. I think eventually what happens is this thing grows, and then it uh just kind of spits out more dust. Did I spawn up here? There has to be a way. There's got to be a way of, of getting these things without murdering yourself over and over and over again. Spawning up there is a little annoying.
use. Yeah, I did. I got a little taller. Mysterious fertilizer. We're using any sapling of mysterious tree grows. This is what we need next. Stone dust. I still don't know how I'm supposed to get clay. Yeah, I gotta make a mysterious tree. I'm guessing I'm just gonna have to get lava from the nether. But I don't know how I'm supposed to make obsidian without lava. No, create death points. Please. Just not obnoxiously big ones. Hold on. I gotta make the dust first. I gotta make the mysterious fertilizer. Can I cook the apples? No. This is this pack is very, very vanilla. Um all I did was add, uh, it's basically just a Hearthwell mod. Just out of curiosity, can I do anything with apples? No, just normal, whatever, Minecraft apples. Um, it's just basically the Hearthwell mod and then, uh, some quality of life things. Jesus Christ, these things go away. Ooh. Oh, that fit perfectly with the music. This thing doesn't drop saplings, though. I know that already because there isn't anything in the JI that says anything about saplings. It just drops its leaves. The wood looks really cool. Does it make purple logs? Yeah, it does. It makes purple planks. That one grew. Alright, and then this is the mysterious mixture. This is just normal wood. Silly fell asleep on the couch or on the chair. We told her to go to bed, so she just grabbed a blanket and curled up on the chair. She refuses to actually sleep in her bed. Um, we're just gonna go ahead and do this. Hello? Thank you. Goose, get in bed, baby. Mixture. This is how you make crystal blocks. Crystal blocks seem to be used for lots of things. Specifically these things. Because these things are used for lots of stuff. Pops a city and glass right off at the expense of some hunger. Mm. 
No, the sad part is I just told her to go get in bed. She's gonna go get in my bed. This doesn't do me much good if I don't have obsidian to pop off. But I can crush it into these things, and these things do all sorts of crazy stuff. So we got these things now. I'm assuming the next step is just to crush the shit out of them and <laughs> see what we get. Because these things do all sorts of stuff. Onyx. I don't know what a dust picker is. That makes a block of coal. I don't know how the cores work. I wonder if I have to break these. Yep. Ah, oh, I broke it too soon. Son of a bitch. I don't know how much that gave me. Did that give me like two? How you doing by the way, Herbie? Thank you for stopping by. Pretty colors! Some more cobble. That's not what I want. This is what I want. I'm doing alright, man. Like I said, we're trying to learn this mod with, like, the least amount of help possible. I'm doing some learning. I'm assuming these things will just keep growing? Yeah, look, it just kept growing. That's cool. I wonder if having a torch next to it helps. definitely grew faster than that one. Alright, so we got more mysterious mixture. Let's make another tree. More. 
Okay. The precision grinder. I can't do any of that unless I have actual iron. Different crystal shards are required for many items throughout the mod, but are easily obtained from mysterious trees. Core blocks and shards use the various shards that you got from crushing crystals on the cores to infuse them with that shard element. Then feed the infused core the required materials to transform it into something else. Okay. He's got charts here. So starting with a rock core. If I give it... Oh, this is how you get iron. Shard of the Sacred Land, I think is what I need. Yep, iron. Shard of the Sacred Land. So I need a stone core. Rock core. Two stone and some slabs. Gives me four of those. Interesting. Okay. Chicken Toper. Uh, I have one of these. Oh, that sucks. I only have one of those. We gotta let's let's get some more things. I think I got this mod figured out. Sorta enough. I have it enough figured out. Uh, like this, yeah, and then like this, yeah, and then like that. Lots of stuff, right? And then, ooh, I got six of them now, okay. So now if I take this cobble, some the stone, I put this down, and I take one of these, bam, I've now, what do they call it? Infused the core. And then I take these things, and I feed it to the core. Nope. I need the block under it too. What's your question, man? I'm not gonna make any guarantees on being able to answer it. So we got iron. Hell yeah. Feed the infused core the required materials to transform it into something else. <laughs> Mom said I can ask you. Yeah, everybody go everybody go look at his YouTube channel. Okay, so it's odd, but it's neat. It's very different. Does it work over here? I don't think it works over here. I think it has to be touching it. I have finger turrets. For some reason the top one doesn't seem like it's bothered. Where am I? Hello. I don't really know like what the what the like uh, rate is like how many times you get to put a block down before it changes kind of thing but I'm guessing the more you do it the better I'm 
just gonna do this, that way it stops heating the block underneath it. I just stand on top of it. Witness. What is this? What is this? Magic. This witchcraft. Block's just mysteriously changing into things. Alright, so we got we got iron, folks. What else can I do with these things? Uh, the rock cores, I can also make coal, gold, soul sand. Oh, that's how I make clay. Okay. That's how I make clay. So if I do... If I do this... Give me a half slab. That should make me clay. Thank for the follow, Tober. This should make me clay. Or at least should make me compress clay anyways. I don't know how that works, but this should make me compress clay. It says nothing around it makes me compress clay. Oh wait, I gotta put a I gotta infuse it. My bad. I'm an idiot. Bam. That'll make me clay. Yep, look, there it is. How do I get normal clay out of this? There it is. Ha! Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Okay, um... Redstone is made with netherrack or magma blocks. But it doesn't look like you can make. That's what I'm trying to find. I'm looking for water. looking for like ice maybe something there has to be something different though that gets you what is mutation paste because this is the rock core so this is the like the the base like this is the first one that you should be like getting and using to make stuff so this one makes coal, iron, gold, soul sand, clay, bone block, redstone block, and mutation paste. Don't know what mutation paste is. What is mutation paste? Oh, it's a literal mutation. Haters. It's kind of like, uh, what is that? What is that mod? It's like equivalent exchange. This doesn't really answer the question of how to get water, but... Basically any like the vanilla food slash plant things, except for flowers. What is, what is the block for? Just makes more mutation paste. Yeah. Um,
None of these appear to actually make water. He's got a list of the recipes up here. None of them actually consume water either, but they do. One of them consumes snow blocks and packed ice. There's a refrigerator that'll freeze nearby water to ice or snow. But there's no water, so there's got to be a way of making ice. <laughs> Near water. Duh. Uh, is there a way... Is there like a bucket that fills up when it rains? Because there's no recipe for water. There's no recipe for packed ice. The freezer... Oh, Jesus Christ. The freezer... Can't really make unless you know how to get this stuff. Uh, crystal block, mysterious dust block. So you can make acyl, acyl iron, whatever the hell that is. How about glowstone netherrack, quartz block, magma block. Some of these I'm not too sure about because the uh, things are multi-blocks. See, this just says the generator block with a simple lava, so lava source beneath it. This block will generate energy required to power your other machines. But, it doesn't tell you how to get the lava. These are the, some of the little things that I, I... I would like to know more about. Not ice. Because lava doesn't have a recipe either. You can go to the nether. The only problem is, you can't go to the nether unless you have lava. But from what I can tell, the only way to get lava is to just have lava. <laughs> that, I don't know. I dug down. I'm assuming it's just stone. I'm seriously just assuming it's just stone down there. All the way down to bedrock. I didn't get the bedrock. I stopped like 20 blocks away, but... I'm just assuming it's a... There is no lava. Because this mod is intended to allow you to get everything you need from right where you are. That's the whole point of the mod. So, it's intended to be able to supply you. It's kind of like X Nilo and all that stuff. It's, a, it's intended to give you the stuff you need from nothing. So, being able to create water and lava should be something that it, it, it can do. I just don't know how. <laughs> That's the thing, I don't know how. I feel like maybe there is a recipe for it, I just have to find it. There's a, there's a way of doing it, it's just I gotta like weed it out of the, out of the wikis and stuff. But my guess is this just goes down to bedrock. If there even is bedrock. It might just be freaking void. But it will be nice knowing if there is bedrock.
Yep, there it is. Okay. Well, it is a flat world, so I was assuming there was a, it's just like one layer of bedrock and then it's void. But it actually is like a full, like, a full underground. Just with, just all stone though. Sorry, I need more cobble anyways. There's a mob in my house, no? Like I went far enough away that the mob spawned. Oh, dick. Grown mysterious bush. Grown mysterious bush. It apparently wasn't grown all the way. That one was apparently grown enough. Okay. Well, let's let's see. None of these things say I need to use water or lava to get stuff from them. Um I can make netherrack with coal blocks from a warm core, but the warm core... What's the recipe for the warm core? Obtained by right-clicking a heat block with a flint and steel. Alright, Kingspot, have a good one, man. Thanks for stopping by. What's a heat block? Heat block, heat furnace, smelts items instantly at no cost, requires a multi-block structure. And it's not going to tell you how to make that multi-block structure, is it? This I need another portal for. Throwing a crystal into the nether portal. Stone with a rock core. A brick, obviously. Make magma blocks. Magma blocks get you slime balls and blaze powder. With the separator. I want to know how to make water. Is there anything like a barrel? Spelled with an N? Barrier block. Pot. Um, drum. Collector. Is that a light collector? That requires nether blocks. The crystal white brackish stone. Salt. That's how you make leather. Okay. And there's no animals because it's all stone. That 
That's the only way? Yeah, okay. Yeah, you keep telling me it's obtained by placing a freezer in your water, but you refuse to tell me where the hell to get water from. I'm gonna figure this out. Tell me how to make a crystal bowl. I made a bucket. Dummy. <laughs> More bones. Okay, how do I get water? How do you make water? What if it's something else? What if it's like some other fluid that you have to make? Like this. Liquid souls. Liquid souls has no recipe. You spawned me outside this time. Damn it. 
No. Uh. There's no, like, bucket of liquid souls. Gravity blocks are mini gravity blocks. What do you do with them? They're all sort of makeable. Just a uh, crafting or not crafting a building thing? Looks like it's just a building thing. Acel machine case, acel ingots, acel blocks. This is the, the this tube recipes thing. I don't know what any of this means. Times two to the negative ten. can make this. Oh, now there's a crystal bowl recipe. Shard picking table. Blaze filled rod. looking blocks. I'm just gonna fucking Google it. are things that I want.
What is that? That's a different recipe. He's got a list of recipes up here that are different than what he's got listed. It's different than what JAI says. Interesting. It's even got a it's even got its own miner. Huh. Nobody's asking how to make water. <laughs> People are having trouble with the amplification tubes. They have no idea what to do with them. something. It's got to be something very simple. I'm just not knowing it because this has no explanation on what to do about anything. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. If I like click this on something. No. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I need water for things. This supposedly has a way to make water. Because it, it has a freezer that, that, that can freeze water. Dice or snow. And lava to obsidian. But I have no idea how to do either of those. How to make lava or how to make obsidian. Or how to make uh, water. 
There isn't any down here. It just goes to bedrock. But there's a way to do it, and I don't know how. So I'm looking at all of the links that he's got and everything. His GitHub page. Everything. Reddit post. Trying to... Trying to... Figure this out. Like, early game... Early game power gen comes from lava. So you have to be able to make lava before you can do that. I just don't know how. He says there is a lava... He doesn't say what it is, but he says there's a lava gen process. There's a way to generate lava. stare at these things until the cows come home. things like like these gravity blocks and stuff like he doesn't explain at all what those are in any of his in any of his things he doesn't explain how to make any of the multi blocks I mean he shows them on this page being assembled but he doesn't tell you what any of the blocks are we just have to figure it out Uh, I'm just gonna fucking send a message. <laughs> like, hey, apparently I'm an idiot. How do you get water? Crucible. It's just there's a there's the what the uh the hell's that thing called?
Well, it looks like he's going to do some actual documentation. I didn't want to get clay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Right there. And there's your lava. Well, the question is, what do you do with this thing? How do you, how do you, how do you use this thing? <laughs> how does this work? So I'm going to make a whole bunch of them and see what happens. Okay. I just need to decipher what this means. Times two minus ten. Assuming sun. Just need to figure out what that means. Um, I need some shears. I need to plant a tree. Yeah, uh, that's what I'm, uh, I'm I'm trying to figure that out. I, I'm looking at it like it's math. Times 2 to 10, or is it like... Of course it's raining, so there's no sun, obviously. Which is perfect. Yeah, between 2 and 10, possibly?
He doesn't have any uh, pictures of what they're supposed to look like set up, so... Again, it's just kind of going to be guessing. But judging by how they connect, I feel like... I feel like if I do this... And then I do like this... Something like that, maybe? It's an amplifying tube, so it's amplifying the light coming through or something, maybe? And just based on the the connected textures. Can I make wool out of string? I can. What's a compressed wool? Compressed wool is a verdant core with nothing. I'm gonna make a verdant core. You're such a dick. They must be coming up from down here. Take that. Charge the light collectors. Turf block. Why do I keep hearing sounds like, like, oh, it's them on fire, that's what it is. Alright, I'm just gonna do this. Confirmed water. Holy crap. I had to look through. I had to dig through his... <laughs> I mean, that's not his fault, I guess, really. But I had to dig through his freaking Discord channel, searching for the word water, just to figure out that it was the tube recipe. I think this is this guy's like first mod too. Judging from what I've been reading. It's not bad for a first mod. And if if he could like, you know, refine some of these like things and maybe get a little bit more direction, you know, in some of the descriptions or whatever, or some some form of uh, guidance. 
even if it's just basic, like getting you to this point. Uh, I, I could see this being better. I mean, I'd, I'd rather use this than sifting over and over and over again. I don't know if you can automate any of this stuff. That might be an issue. I mean, you could probably automate this. It only works during the daytime, though. You just need something to place that there. And then something to pick up the water. You can automate lava this way. How many is there? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You can have ten of these. Lava's just stone, right? See, if I click on this though, it should bring me to that recipe. That's the problem I have. If I click on the lava, and it doesn't bring me to the recipe that shows me how to make lava, that's an issue I have. That's something I'd like to see changed. You have to look up use for tubes. to find out it's a lava recipe. What's the recipe for this crap again? Charcoal, stone, and wood. I want the click. Give me the click. Is it? I think it's coal blocks. You can make coal blocks with logs, with the rock cores. Uh, it's nighttime. How much string do I have? I have enough for one wolf. It sucks. I can't make a burden core. Again, turf blocks. I don't have any dirt. Dirt. Dirt is made with that uh, dust put next to water. This stuff put next to water turns into dirt. Mysterious bush right there. Uh, let's see. Um, stone, 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 more stone. Okay. I'm making stone. Good, I'm thinking ahead. stone. And then plant a tree. It's 
fine. Come on in. I need your string. Come on in. I don't know if it has to be a source block or not. But it's just water in general. Okay, so that light thing came from a light thing. It comes from a light thing. A light collector. I have to build another portal before I can build a light collector. That thing that breaks obsidian? Displacer. How many crystals do I? I'm gonna make that shit again. Mysterious mixture, yeah. Can't burn leaves. things before you can get flint. things. Raw asshole, crystal block, clay, mysterious dust block.
Apparently these gravity blocks let you fly. But it's more like swimming in the air. Spiders. Can I get more iron? Oh yeah, that's what I need all the stone for, right? I guess you could automate this process. You would have to have like a lot of like block placers. Just placing things over and over and over again. I almost made a cauldron. That's a skelly horse over there. Really hope there's no lightning. Oh, I just need to kill you quickly. Ah, <laughs> try to run away. Go away, rain. Right, it's over there. 
What do skeleton horses drop? There it is. Ha! <laughs> so freaking close. Tired of the rain. your magic. Come on, give me stuff. Things where like a uh, progress bar would would be helpful. Giggity. want to run off into a direction and try to get some spiders to spawn. If I can get more dirt, if I get this the dirt to turn to dirt, turn to dirt. Yeah, turn to dirt. I can just make like a bunch of this grass like along here. Nothing's gonna spawn in the daytime, is it? Not even spiders, huh? Suck. I mean, I get an animal to spawn if I get far enough away from my base. Thank you.
Oh look, that one already changed. This one still ain't having it. I wonder why that one changed so much faster. Now the sun's going down. Awesome. Hey, look. All right, cool. Can't make this thing anyways, but oh well. Uh, what did I need to make? I was trying to make, oh, the saw. What's it called? Is it called a saw? It's not called a saw, is it? Is it called like a grinder? I think it's a grinder. No? Grinding wheels. What's it called? Yeah, it's called a grinder. There it is. Jesus Christ. Asshole machine case. Asshole. You're an asshole. I'm pretty sure this is going to need power, though. So I'm going to have to make lava at some point. Like, right now. Of course, there's no sun. I think this has to actually be like the dirt in the ground, like dirt. Not just next to it, but like here. Could be dangerous. No, oh, this is still gonna work. Sucker. Are you fucking kidding me? is very uh, reliant on sunlight too. Oh, 
I just don't want it to burn down my, my wall. My big, beautiful, strong wall. Aha! I don't have my bucket, son of a bitch. Ugh. I don't know where I'm gonna keep this. <laughs> One. I don't know why that one's working faster than the other one. That one just seems to be working faster than all the other ones for some reason. Come on. Aw, oh, son of a bitch. I just slept. It wasn't raining then.
This one just doesn't want to change. Well, that's something I learned today. These blocks have gravity. Plus we have what, like six blocks? Oh, nine blocks. Damn, more than I thought. Uh, I'm gonna make more cores. Do I have more cores in here? I do. Keep forgetting that I gotta put one of these in it.
Ah. Aí. Yeah. Come on. Got enough to build a portal. Now I just gotta make a. Uh... One more of these. Gimme. Then this is my fuel source. Can't make this yet. Uh, grinder. Crystals I got. Machine case I got. Amplifying tube I need to make. Got that. Got that. has three on there. I'm not making three. That goes there. And then I need a generator. Heat generator. Four more crystals. A red shard. Another one of these. I 
a red shard. Four crystals I got. Onyx is just a stone surrounded by something. I seen it. Where'd I seen it? It's like stone surrounded uh, a black one or something like that. I think it's this. Stone? Maybe cobble. No, stone. I saw that recipe somewhere, but God forbid it showed me on actually JUI. You. Oh, I just spent all my stone, didn't I? I'm a jackass. Alright, now we're gonna make this place bigger. I would just vein mine, but it'd probably vein mine everything <laughs> out of existence. Ah, oh, mother trucker. Oh god. Oh, it's a tragedy. Side. Just make a bigger wall around. Some of this nonsense in here. I'm supposed to be able to do... Can I just do this? Can I do this? No. Do I have to place this first? Oh god, that's right, it's a multi-block. Oh, son of a whore. heavy blocks, nine protection blocks, two slab lamps. Ugh. I forgot. Okay. Slab lamps. I need more of that stuff, don't I? I don't have anywhere near enough. Charcoal stone and birch. Can I just use cobble? Damn it, I was hoping I could use cobble.
Uh, give me more stone. Just give me a stack. Please. Heavy blocks. Four heavy blocks. Damn it, I need a lot of this crap. I need a wand. Speed things up. <laughs> hey, those, uh... Fidurts? Fidurts? Fertile? Fertile soil. Fertilizer block. Ooh, I don't have any of this stuff. Have I managed to actually kill a creeper yet? I don't think I've even managed to kill a creeper yet. They all explode. Rip. sure how it's supposed to go there and then the generator which I can just make can I already make it I already made it generator goes above it what I don't know is how I put a multi block near it or on it or how how it gets its power. Like, I don't know if it uses the tubes or... It's going to suck to build a multi-block and then have it not work. Oh, 
wonder if it uses these things as like power transfer. Don't think like a pipe or anything or whatever these things are, dust pickers. Where does this shit come from now? A heavy ingot, an iron ingot, and an acyl ingot. Are you shitting me? So how much of this shit am I gonna need? I need nine of these things. I'm gonna have to do it three times. So that's at least 12 of those, plus fucking shit. Ugh. Well, I know I'm gonna need a lot. So many furnaces. So much fern eye. Cobble gen, for God's sakes! I'm gonna, I'm gonna freaking plant it full of stone, and I need to make a cobble gen. <laughs> I just want to make my base bigger, bigger, bigger. Yeah, it's basically the guy made the mod and then made this mod pack to showcase the mod. Uh, I've added a bunch of things to it. Uh, it's not... It, the, the pack was basically... Hi, Pixel. The pack was basically just... Uh, um, his mod. And then... Uh, like, JDI and Forge. Like, that was about it. So I added, you know, some quality of life things. But yeah, no. Uh... It's been a struggle trying to figure out how the hell to get started in this thing. I've been to like five different websites just trying to learn how to get to this point. And some of the stuff I'm still guessing. Well, the main problem is there's no in-game documentation. 
he just kind of there's nothing pointing you in a direction other than like what the very very first thing to do which is to plant a seed and you grow this little patch of grass kind of thing yeah yeah, yeah. so he's he's like still still like got things working I mean, it's cool. I, I like the I like the way it's it's working, the mechanics stuff. But I'm trying to learn how to do it because <laughs> there's 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 some stuff that tells you some things, but I uh, like there's multi blocks and stuff. I go on his website to try to see like what the multi blocks, how to put them together, and things. And some stuff isn't really explained very well. Like, it took me forever to figure out how to just to make water. Because when you click on the water recipe, it doesn't show you the recipe for water, even though there is one. Like, you click on water, it does nothing. But there is a recipe for water. You have to click on tube. uses and that that'll show you where the water is that also shows you where the lava is but other than that like that I've been like you know trying to think of ways to like automate it because a lot of the things like rely on like here like this thing I actually have to make some more of the stuff so Like this mechanic right here. Like I think I've read in one of the, I was, was on one of the, I think it was on his Discord page. That you can put the, you can put the entities here, the block here, and you can push it with a piston into it, and it'll have the same effect. I think. I'm not sure. Either that or you're just pushing it off of a ledge and then pushing it back and then pushing it back up again and then pushing it off a ledge. Something like that. He said he used pistons. The guy said he was using pistons. Alright, these are all empty. I need to make more of this stuff. Four charcoal. I'm in dire need of more wood. I should just make cores. Cutting down trees is annoying. Uh, Like, I got a multi-block structure that I need to build. And it needs 100 energy supplied to it. This is the thing that's generating my energy. I don't know how much it generates. No idea how much it generates. I don't know if I need four of these, or one of them, or... Oh wait, here we go. So on the website it says... Produces and holds up to 120 energy in a radius of 10 blocks. The lava might not last forever though. So... I can put the multi-block anywhere within 10 blocks, I guess, and it's like... A... like... 
AOE energy. Uh, I need... I want to put a half slab down so I can tell if the freaking lava disappeared. So I have three, I need four, I need nine protection blocks. I don't have enough heavy blocks for that, I can guarantee you that. Just enough. Two slab lamps. So that means I gotta make more. Slab lamps are torches. Torches and heavy, heavy, uh, heavy uh, ingots, right? Heavy ingots, yep. Two of these. And the precision, the precision grinder. Alright, so that goes. Has to go. The mod, the the picture showing it flush. I'm trying to see if it's like stairs. Get to move it? No. Is there a wrench? Is there a wrench in this mod? Can I use this thing? No wrench. Yeah, I might have to. Watch, I bet you the place is upside down though. What you want to bet? The place is facing the wrong way. Oh, no, it worked. Just tall enough. In my shitty ass base. 
So supposedly, supposedly this is built wrong. Supposedly it's like that. I have no idea what these light blocks are for. And this one's facing the wrong way. I don't know if this is supposed to like form either into something. Oh wait. Oh it's double sided. Okay, I didn't know that. Never mind. I thought I was facing the wrong one. I didn't realize it was double sided. I have no idea what to do with this thing now, nor if it's working. You should see the furnace. <laughs> the furnace contains water. Like four blocks of it. Uh, I'm assuming you just throw it in there? I guess you just throw it in there, huh? Does cobble get me gravel? That's a shitty recipe. Iron bar, three nuggets. Cobble gets me gravel. that whole thing. Okay, well, we got gravel. I am out of iron. Yeah. Um, I don't think this is the only way to generate lava, or lava power. I think this is just maybe the beginning of it, but if there's other sources, I don't know. <laughs> I guess unless uh, you just use a lot of these instead. And I don't know if there's a battery of any sort or any, like, storage. Pops almost everything right off. An empowered displacer. <laughs> I don't know if the intention is to, is to just have a source of power to get started and then maybe other mods to kick in after that kind of thing.
give me... That's all I need, I just need to light it. I don't even really need to go there. I just need to light it. Hey buddy. Still running in circles? place bigger. I need to get to the other side of that thing. I should make an axe. I should really make an axe. Let's make an axe. We're making an axe. Can I use this? I can use that stuff. on a solo player. Let me get some torches. chest.
Alright, so what can I make now? I can make the, uh, I can make the nether stuff now. I can make one of these things. I can make another crystal now. Throw in a crystal into the nether portal. So, that means I can make shards from those. Whatever these things are. Zombie loot kits? Produced in a loot kit producer. I guess they've maybe dropped spawn? Like, uh, not spawn, uh... They dropped the loot, maybe? It's the heat furnace. This is part of the multi-block structure. Heat block. You need to make a light collector in order to make verdant blocks. Stone. Shard of the Sacred Land. I need more of those shards. It's not how you get shards. I need. The crystal thing? Crystal block. I need crystal block. Which is the Mysterious Mixture, yes. The good old Mysterious Mixture. things. Really? One? One. Shards. I'm getting lots of these ones. Give me cobble. Some of these rock cores. Let's get some more iron.
Alright, we got some more iron now. Uh, what do we want to make next? Oh, I need that light collector. That's what we're making, is the light collector. And this was these, which is... Uh, this. This. Yes. That. I just used all of them because I'm a freaking genius. Let's go power everything with fucking slabs. Yeah, automation is one of those things that, that this mod is going to have a little bit of trouble with, I think. It's going to take some getting like creative with it kind of thing. It's also fairly dependent on light as well, so like things don't really work in, in the dark. These things don't work in the dark. They need sunlight. This stuff doesn't grow unless it's bright out. Uh, this stuff over here doesn't turn into dirt unless the sun's out, I'm assuming. Uh, it does give you this block, this fertile soil, which lets trees grow, like, instantly. You put the sapling down and it grows instantly. Like, this block right here, it needs light. Apparently, all this does is it just spits these things out. Drops from charged light collectors. I, I don't, I don't know how to charge them. I'm just assuming you stick them out in the open with the sun. I'm gonna go in here and see what's in here. This is a vanilla nether, so I'm not worried about there being anything crazy going on in here. It's gonna break. Although. Can I get this glowstone? Before my pick breaks. all of those. Story of my life. And my pick still didn't break.
What the? Oh, they must have went through when I broke the when I was breaking down the wall. It's like where the where the hell did those things come from? I don't see any soul sand. Ooh, is that some over there? That's some over there. climb up to kill myself. <laughs> oh, come on. Fine. Needs food. Thank you. <laughs> Okie doke. So, I can do other things now. Oh, let's see, there's the freezer, which makes snow and ice, and turns lava into obsidian. It doesn't sound like anything I really need right now. Can make a burning core now as soon as I can get some of those things, those light things. I have no idea how this machine works. Oh look. Oh look. It's changing. It's blushing now. shake. Yep. I want to see this thing come to fruition. As I chomp on carrots. I've eaten almost a whole bag of carrots. I'm gonna be shitting carrots. It's gonna be straight orange dump.
Do something. Ooh, I need seeds too. Because verdant cores will get you melons and pumpkins, lapis, wool. Need to make TNT to get a melon. Quartz blocks get you prismarine. Pumpkins. Mushrooms. What do you need for a warm core? A faster furnace? I can. Eventually. Right clicking a heat block with a flint and steel, just be careful. What's a heat block? Did we look up a heat block before? Heat block. Clay. Yeah, the 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 furnace is instantaneous it says. multi-block structure that will cook and smelt without delay or consumption of materials. It will, however, sometimes consume some water from the top. It's huge, too. There's also a thing called the separator, which allows you to divide complex constructions into its components. And there's a thing called the puller, which is a Basically, it's a quarry. The structure that pulls ores from nothing, really, it says. <laughs> the higher you build it, the faster it pulls. It looks like it's built with a lot of heat blocks. Protection blocks, looks like heat blocks, protection blocks. It's got some of the tubes. It's got this thing. I really wish this game had, uh, this game, this mod had a little bit more documentation to it just because there's a lot of stuff in here that I have no idea what it even is or where it comes from. Like, what do you do with these blaze-filled rods? It's got a crop grower. Freezer. What are the zombie totems? What are the totems, you know? What's this shard-picking table? What's a block boxer? What's a powered gravity block for? Loot kit producer. Like, there's a lot of things in here. Smooth Azerite. There's a lot of pretty blocks. Sentient core? This is like the ultimate core. The core of all cores. There's even ore. Glowstone ore and quartz ore. Where do those spawn? I hear a zombie pigman. Sweet. 
Soul Steel. These loot kits. No idea what those are. Like, there's just a lot of stuff in here that you just don't like. Dust pickers. What the what the heck is a dust picker? What's the Mystic Iron Dagger for? Like these all have daggers. Raw repairing paste. Makes repairing paste. Place it on your left hand to slowly repair items on your right hand. Well, isn't that special? But see, little things like that are, are handy, you know? It gives you a little blurb. You're still charging up, it looks like. every jump hit I've tried. I really want to know what it's going to do. What's a shard picking table? What does this do? Can I just make one of these for shits and giggles? Ascension core recipe. It takes actual diamond. Where the hell do you get diamond from? What makes diamond? Diamond block is the ascension core with redstone blocks. How do you make the ascension core? Glowstone and lapis. You can make redstone from netherrack with the rock core. I don't know what that's for. I don't know what it does. This thing's still not doing nothing. the purple. I dig it.
You're gonna be doing something. I don't know what, but you'll be doing something. So you're giving me light things. Kinda wanna just build that furnace in, in greater mode just to see what it does. See how it operates. Boxes, the tubes themselves. We need water, lava. We need protection blocks. source generator so this goes two three It's the furnace. Lava. Weird, there's like a gap in the back. Huh. There's a gap there. I guess that's where it spits it out. Wouldn't the lava get in there? Would it just run into the lava? Doesn't seem right. No, it must go to the end. Yeah, it goes all the way to the end. Block there. Block there. 
there. Not there. What was confusing me. I'm like, why is this not right? There, 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 there. And then water, 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 water. And that's the furnace. Shake a mega. Throw it in there and it spits it out the ass end, right? Yep. <laughs> it says it sometimes will consume water from the top, but otherwise it needs no fuel. But the water disappears sometimes. Which is weird because there should be an infinite water source up here. But it, water disappears and it doesn't fill itself in. At least it's instant. So that's the furnace. Just getting around for work, you know? I should probably be going to bed. <laughs> Cool thing about this though is that all these all these machines only take a hundred energy, so you can run them off of their own off their own one of these things. That's it. And it'll be plenty. I want to make the puller. Protection blocks, uh, like water. collector, there's something else in that block that I can't tell what it is. build these things the better. Supposedly. What the hell am I playing? This is called uh, Hearthwell. It's a new uh, X and Ilo type mod. It's a new something from nothing mod. Assuming this thing needs to be down here. But it's got multi block machines, and they're really odd. Is that water in the middle? What the fuck is in the middle of that thing? 
this this mod like came out basically two days ago. And I'm trying to figure out how to do it. And it's uh hard because there's not much telling you how to do it. I can't tell what that middle block is. It looks like maybe water? Something that needs to go in here. It's not blue though. is. I also like to know I don't think it's water. I don't think it's glass. Clear, whatever it is. It's like a clear block. What is this stuff? It's working, because look at it, it's freaking out. It's doing stuff, so it's doing things. I just don't know. Does the ore just show up in there, maybe? faster it pulls it says still pulling energy so I don't know if that means it's working or not
Hmm. This, whatever this stuff is, Liquid Souls, it looks really cool though. It's like Bifrost water. I wonder if that'll still pull if I break this. RGB water? Yeah. <laughs> See, it's still pulling anyway, so I don't even know, like, there's no way to tell if it's, like, broken or not. It just works. It's, it's just pulling anyway. It's pulling the energy anyway, so... I don't know how to tell if it's not working. Nothing has a nothing has a GUI, so it's like I don't. I just want to see things happen. Anti-gravity block. Powered anti-gravity block. Oh. Oh god. Huh. Huh. Whoa, dude. It's like swimming. When you look up, you go up. I'm holding shift. Oh, but trying to go side to side? Forget about it. You gotta look in the direction you wanna go. <laughs> That's a very short range. Oh. Oh, it's really janky. It's really janky. the anti-gravity. What's the gravity? Apparently everything's okay. Is this like a crafting block? Oh, this is that's the box. It has nothing to do. That's just the box. Powered gravity block is what I need. No? Has no uses? Whatever. I wonder what an Enderman totem does. these things do somebody write a book
Wait, what the fuck is a dust picker? Does this stuff just... Uh, I, don't, I don't get it. Maybe a chest? No? The model makes it really hard to see what that block is on the inside. But I'm pretty sure it's freaking... It, it's like... it's a something. It looks like a liquid. size right here. That's the minimum size. Turn into obsidian. That's funny. idea of what this thing would do is it would be spitting things out right here how you collect them is a uh, no clue but things. You can stand on it. I have to wait till like I don't know, I guess I could just get in his Discord and be like, hey, explain these things to me. <laughs> it's got some nifty little features, but it needs a uh, it needs a little bit of help. And for what I think is this guy's first mod, I mean Hell yeah, kudos to you. I just need to explain what this shit does. It's a weeping block. It's just five gas tears? <laughs> okay. Did a weird thing. It's 
See, this to me sounds like something that would you would plant. It's a seed. And then it would burst into stuff. I still, I still haven't seen this thing give off any of the the light stuff that it's supposed to be giving off. Oh shit! This thing spread. It's late. I gotta go to bed or something for like an hour. And uh, get up. <laughs> so, y'all have a good day. Thanks for watching. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for pressing all the little buttons. And you, uh, much loves. Much loves. Y'all have a good one. There you go.